In this demonstration, you will learn how to generate an efficient mesh and optimize the model topology. The geometry is ready to mesh with shell elements. The mesh menu is selected to open. 2D Auto Mesh is selected to open the Auto Mesh panel. All surfaces are selected using the Displayed option. For this example, a couple of small surfaces will be removed from the selection and mesh separately. The element size for the mesh is set to 5 millimeters. The mesh button is clicked to view the mesh. The mesh scene is a proposal for the final mesh. The mesh appears too fine, so the size is changed to 10 millimeters. The Recalc All button is clicked to recalculate the mesh with the new element size. The mesh button is clicked to mesh the part again. Since the mesh is just a proposal, the mesh can be actively and interactively changed. Clicking the density allows the number of elements on the edge to be interactively changed up or down. Clicking the mesh button shows the new mesh. Edges can also be set to the number entered into the element density field. With 20 entered, the edges are selected to set the number. Clicking the Mesh button updates the mesh to the new edge densities. Once the mesh is acceptable, it can be accepted and it is then associated with the geometry. The mesh is now accepted and associated to the geometry. One area to review the mesh is where multiple surfaces come together. It can now be seen that the surfaces connected by the green lines have coincident nodes as they were connected properly. The surfaces removed from the selection will now be selected to create a mesh. With the surfaces selected, the mesh button is clicked to view the mesh. The densities can be adjusted on the new mesh. The mesh button is clicked to review the new density settings. The mesh is accepted for the surfaces by clicking the return button. At any time, the model can be remeshed, including elements, not just surfaces. Elements are selected on the model for remeshing. The mesh button is clicked to remesh the elements. The density is changed to make a better mesh. The mesh button is clicked to view the new mesh. The new mesh is accepted by clicking return. The associativity of the mesh to the geometry is conserved even if the geometry changes. The quick edit functionality is used to edit the geometry. The edges of the surface will be suppressed using the toggle edge function. Suppressing the edges means they will not be considered by the mesh. The edges are selected to suppress them. Notice the mesh change as the edges suppress.